Hey guys, since Easter is coming up pretty soon, I thought I'd do a little things that you should know about rabbits before you get one for Easter. Because rabbits are cute, but they're a lot more work than you think that they are. So here's some things you need to know before you get a rabbit. Con number one for rabbits. They can be very, very destructive. And they like to eat cord, you know, chew on wires, which is very bad. And I let mine in her play area and she escaped her play area and I come back to find that she had chewed my Wii cord to my Wii U and it charges the I can replace it but still and she chewed my phone charger which is just lovely but that's con number one they can destroy anything and everything and cords are very dangerous for them and they can still find a way even if you think they can't get to them they are escape artists that's con number two yes these very cute and cuddly creatures can escape many places and they can chew cords like that a con about them is they're pretty calm animals i mean a pro they're pretty calm animals and they're pretty nice animals but this may be a con because they're prey animals so they're sometimes scared some rabbits can be aggressive but she's sweet other than chewing on some cords but yeah other than that she's a pretty good rabbit now let's talk aggressive rabbits i had a rabbit named bella this is not her but she looked like the one on the screen but she would like bite you all the time i don't know if it was because she was scared but some rabbits can be like that and bite you a lot so just know that and be aware of that when you get a rabbit i don't know if this is a con or a pro but you need to be aware if, if you're gonna get a rabbit that they don't like to be picked up they like to be petted, but picked up, they don't enjoy that that much. Um, rabbits need some space to roam around. So, my setup is not the best setup, but I have seen secrets around my cage, and I have this big, extra large cage by Living World, which I would recommend if you're going to get a rabbit. Also, there's many different living situations. My friend Daisy, this is her and her rabbit. He's completely free range, I believe. And I believe she loves it, but only certain rabbits can do free range. I think free range is good, but you have to have a certain situation for it to work for the owner and the rabbit. And now let's talk about hutches. Hutches are good cages if you get a big enough size. But I personally wouldn't have my rabbit outside, especially when you're... If you're in a colder climate. But if you think a hutch would work for you. Just make sure your rabbit feels safe in it. And yeah. Also DIY cages are awesome. Like cages just made out of CNC grids. You can make cages out of all kinds of stuff. Wood. Uh, storm rabbits. She's made her cage out of CNC grids. And it's connected to her bed. And it's really cool. And there's people that have rabbit rooms. If that's possible, that would be awesome. But if you just want to buy a store-bought cage, buy one that's at least as big as this one and add an attachment onto it. And always make sure your rabbit has hay and water. And right there I have carrots and I'll fill pellets up after she's done with her carrots. And always make sure your rabbit has a hide. See, she has two hides. One in her play area. And this is a hide in her cage. I know this from experience, but I've heard two, better, two rabbits are better than one. I've had three rabbits, and I've only had them on by themselves. But they've done perfectly fine by themselves. And uh, if you get two rabbits... Get them spayed and neutered so they don't have babies, but yeah. And even if you get two females, they say to spay and neuter them because they can get aggressive and stuff if you don't mind. Is their lifespan. They can live between 10, uh, 10 to 12 years. Uh, 
normally around 10 is the longest that they live. But I had a rabbit named Coco. This is a picture of me and Coco, and he lived 11 years. He was super sweet, and he would let you hold him and even dress him up in clothes. People also say that rabbits are not good for small children, but I was really small when we had him. And yes, your parents will be doing a lot of the work, but I think having rabbits with children can work. Did I talk about their food? You'll have to feed them hay, Timothy hay, and you'll have to make sure they have water. And you can give them fruits and vegetables, but be cautious what fruit you give them. Because certain fruits can have too much sugar in it. You can also feed them rabbit feed complete. But hay and vegetables is the best to have the most of that in their diet. The con is their cage can be really stinky, especially if you keep them inside. But you need to clean their cage every few days. And uh, you can also litter box train rabbits. If your rabbit is free range, litter box train. Then you can litter box train them if they have a cage. You can put it on one side and you can figure out which side. When you first get your rabbit, figure out which side of the bathroom that, you know, which side of the cage they like to use the bathroom. And then put the litter box on that side. And then put, uh, when you clean their cage, put whatever's left over like a paper towel and wipe stuff up and then put it in their litter box and then they should learn how to use it but I don't have a litter box she mostly goes to the bathroom on one side but that's just that and I just prefer to do the whole cage to think about before you get a rabbit is rabbits can get sick and they're not the cheapest animals they're not the highest animals but they're not the cheapest animals their food and stuff is pretty reasonable but if your rabbit gets sick like our rabbit Coco got ear mites one time and that cost a lot of money and stuff to go to the vets and stuff that cost money. So just think about that when you get any animal. Say you can't bond with your rabbit. That is a total lie. They are such rewarding creatures to have. They make me smile and I just love them. I often think that rabbits are born pet to have. That is totally a lie. They are so fun to watch it hop around and play and just feed them funny little sweet selves. I just love her and I'd recommend a rabbit, but you just got to take all these things into consideration. Just think about these things before you think that, uh, oh, rabbits are so cute. Let's get one because it's close to Easter. Think again because they're a animal. And they have a life to live and they could live up to 12 years guys so just think about that love you guys karma love you say bye bye